So uh, the venue we come for 24 hours is Orchid Lake in Oxfordshire. Absolutely, just had a walk round and everything. Absolutely cracking venue. We've been told it's a very hard lake by the bailiff, but if you do catch, you know, you, you catch some really nice, decent fish. They call it Home in the 30s. Home, was it Home in the 30s yeah. or the 30s Club or something like that? Something to do with 30s. I reckon there's about 40 of them, was it? So we're like 40, 30s in here. So. They said, yeah, very hard waters. There's definitely easier waters to fish at, but if you catch, then you know you're gonna have a damn good fish. Absolutely, loads of 20s. So let's just hope that one of us actually catch, and it's not you, Mr. Bumpy. So as we said, it's, it's his first 24 hours, so hopefully you're gonna be a good boy, yeah? <coughs> yeah? You better be. Better be, actually, it's a long walk home, isn't it? So we will let you know, as we said, it's Orchid Lakes in Oxfordshire. On the way in, just when we paid and everything, we met um, Peter, Peter, Peter Ralph, who was here on <laughs> Carp Headbangers video, and they'd done a video with him, and he'd been here for four years, and he was here for 13 months on the one peg. Now, he has been here for six years, so that means, doing my calculations, he's been here for two and a half years on one peg. And they said he's got all his marbles and all that, so... I don't think his wife has. Yeah. Then again, she might have if she's got rid of him. <laughs> if he's over here <laughs> yeah. and she's at home. Yeah. So, yeah, I think which one I'd rather be. I wouldn't want to be on a bank for six years. So, um, We'll see if we can cop him on video. He's got no week in there, but he's 72 years out of age and he looks absolutely fantastic. Apart from his hearing. He's like, what? What's he say? Huh? What's he say? What's he saying? Huh? What's he say? Off there he's going to see Rob. He's on the in-between swim. Oh, he's actually out, he's busy. I've just caught him, you can see him through there. So we'll go there and have a quick chat with him. There you go. It's a lovely little cell. Old stalker, Rob. How you doing, Rob? Oh, no. All I know is, I've we go on to there. You are your the semi file in there, pointing out. I heard them, but didn't see them. You didn't see them. Done about 40 or 50 all the way from that. Um, all the way to the corner, thank you. And then I've just gone up on the embankment, and you can see right on the top, and you've seen a couple of swirls there, and a couple of dark shadows. Uh, I think they are out there. I think they are out there, but that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to put one of my rods in there, because I've so done the 2 3 is out. I'm going to come off the sweet put another one. Put a 2 3 down there. Oh, yeah, 2 3 down there. Yeah. Oh, that's my good, is it? Let's see how tidy he is. Oh my god, all he does is eat. They're, you had a problem with them because they're sticky baits, and that's sticky. <laughs> they're really dry and they won't stick to nothing. Um, it'd be nice if I don't run now. I'd be awesome, wouldn't it? What happens if I pull this? <laughs> I'm back into our swim now. So just told Rob he wants to eat exactly. Two one safe, I'll give you that. Don't even start biting up over that island. Get it prepped for tonight. Hello mister. Why ain't the thing you've been put back? Oh, step off. You had anything yet, Bomb? No, nothing. Put that thing back there, Nelly. You, Tommy T, you're not going to believe this. Just cast it out. Look what, what I've got. caught.
A fox bard? Are you kidding me? Is it all working? That is a question. <laughs> Can you believe that, Doc?